Hey guys, this is Kyle. I'm waiting for at 2 in the afternoon. I still have time for at the Zoom video live streaming. As we continue to stay safe in our homes, we hope you can join us again on Zoom in the honor of the World Down Syndrome Day. As we will be creating for the carbon paper transfer and wiki six and 3D join with the New York base, it was all inspired for the Rachel Carroll Cohen of Shelter Gallery. Now this is what I'm going to use for the wiki stick. Now you can model this. You can make a turtle, a snake, even a tiger, whatever animals you want to, just like a sculpture. Now you also need a 12 color pencils that you can add, or you can evenly draw whatever. As you can tell you, that I want to give you guys it has to use it for the color pencil to draw in this one, like a, that you went to the Museum on the Modern Art. It's just like a frame, it, but either way. Now, this is what that she's already printed on the computer paper. Now, I have about like four or so on, four or six white computer paper. See what I have here? The tissue paper. Now this is looks like a bottle of tissue paper. This is what you use loose for. We just get right in through. And also have a really disposable papers. And I'm not sure what you call what kind of paper they're gonna use it. I'm just going to ask for the essential eyes foundation what kind this paper, what it costs for a tissue paper or something, or the about the computer paper. So, when you get to start the essential eyes foundation, I'm going to be on live streaming and we can get to connection for it. So, let's get to work. Alright, first thing we're going to do the drawings using with the carbon paper. You're going to this is the shiny one, has the lots of ink to cover, just like tissue paper. You got to we're going to so flip I'm this. Gonna, I'm, I'm gonna mute most people All right. and I'm not gonna welcome you to the spotlight. Right, flip I it over. Oh, good job. Alright. And then That's just great. just make sure to see the light on. Oh, these are awesome. You can print these whatever you want. It is completely up to you what you if you don't have a printer, just use this. Ryan and family. This is awesome. Thank you for sharing. All right. You Anyone can. Want to share the this is going to be just a shade of the ink. And and um, get the pencils going. Ah, we have another one from Christine. That you want. All right. Get to trace that. Hi, Christine. Hey. Just want to hold that one. I'm just give that test to see. How it just goes. Great to see you again. They're great. These are so easy. finished his over there. Nice. This is the only way I can personally draw. It's so fun. <laughs> Looks nice. And you guys can do this on wood, nice. on canvas. Looks nice. Do you want to do the paper? My new picture. I'm on new picture. Yeah. And did he use Bob Ross? Do you want one of these? I want one of these. So you hold your painting or drawing against the camera. I will bring you in. I would like you to talk about. Ooh. I love that. It's a rabbit. This is Houston's drawing. Hi, Houston. Houston, say hi. Hi, Damien. Hi, Damien. She made a rabbit. Good job, baby. Is a rabbit your favorite animal? So we did it because of Easter. Oh, <laughs> oh, 
Yeah, Let's see how it goes, Gwen. Oh, it's getting me wet. Uh, nice I mean, job, Gloria. That looks at, just like the painting. Just like this is a really perfect oh, one. Oh, that looks great. Thanks. What do you think it is? Hey. Right. This might be perfect one. Okay. Alright, let's keep it drawing. Here you are, sign your size up afterward. Bye. You can see how yeah, transferred into this white yeah, paper Christine, that I kept tracing really hard. And, and like these kind of tools. Now I'm going to color in using with the color pencils. Ooh. Yeah, I can see someone else's looks uh, perfectly great. I'm gonna go wow, that looks cool. just to give it a little shade. Thank you. Nice job, guys. Mm, thanks. Just to make it nice and Ooh. evenly fashionable. These are so great. Here by the echo sound, let me just keep shading over after we have just a shiny side down with a carbon. Choose Whoa. any different colors that might be it. Alright, let me get that right in Drew. Hey guys, I made this. Okay. Ryan did not have carbon paper, so he used tracing paper over a picture and he'll color it in on there. If you can see it. Looks beautiful, Ryan. Okay, good. Can they see it? Yeah. You see it, right? Yes. Okay, great. Yeah. Very resourceful. That looks nice. Mm. Look what everyone else has. Oh, okay. I love it. Yeah. Go ahead, Ryan. Now you can try color. Okay. Can he color it in? Yes. Yeah, if you haven't started coloring, go ahead. Very good. Uh, let me it's just a little okay. more light. Yeah. There we go. And I'm just going to get this right on the windows. I'm going to get this to rest. How are we doing there? Did we, did we produce carbon copy? Alright, I'll be back. Hmm. This might be a uh, shade word. Hmm. And the answer is actually quite a bit. <laughs> Um, I might be showing to so this for exceptional eyes. Using the same drawing in the same area four or five times. And I can keep going with it and it'll still keep picking up. Um, and you'll see like so many areas don't always get used that, you know, it might be a lighter line starts coming through, but I, I've used, I use them until they go and it takes a long time. Uh, what do you think it is? I'm thinking about them. <laughs> I'm obsessed with everything. You can see how shady it was. Oh. I'm seeing that color. Can you just give me your phone? Thanks. Very nice. Except your eyes love this one. Stephen, what are you working on over there? I like it. You can see it larger. Yeah. 
Right, I hear what Rachel says. You can add something for it. Any details okay, you want it for. Coloring. You can glue them together, cut with some of your magazine to stick it right onto this. It is completely up to you. That's what Rachel just said for it. It doesn't really matter whatever you can this prefer is, this, this one. Uh, if you don't have furniture, uh, just draw your own. Alright, I just drew it myself that I don't have any printer. But what I like to do, I can use it with the pencil to draw any excess computer paper that I trace this. You know, anyway, I flip it inside down, really shiny one. And I'm gonna see how I'm doing really, 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 really um, easy one. Um, just like you can go to substitute. Okay, um, hopefully this is gonna be on. Yeah, I just already finished the carbon paper. Like I said, tissue paper. Okay, I'm just gonna write it aside. Okay, this is gonna be on the echo sound. Hopefully. And I'll we'll just add it right into Well we're there. Almost gonna make it. Draw any other pictures you can. The ever printed it is. Uh, you can also make it with black and white or any different ideas. Hopefully, you could be able to just look on it on this perfectly. Um, just, just want to get this right in through. Hear that echo sound? But I just already decided this. I'll be showing it to the next one. Well, he sees about they like their champagne. Hopefully, you gotta give it a big thumbs up for everyone. Right. Oh, let's see Gloria. Ooh, I love your flower. I'm gonna give you guys the rest. Whoops, hold on. Let me just get it real quick. Alright, let's give it to for a just a little eyes foundation. That we, there we go. Let's give you guys the for just a real. So you see, I hear that echo sound. So it just so does speak if real. you feel like you're finished and you feel like you've added some color and you feel like you're just like over it, um, some of you might feel the opposite way and want to keep working on this all day and that's pretty cool too. Um, but I do want to take some time to show you my next favorite material. <laughs> Um, and we're going to look at how these two projects can actually fit together. Um, so it's okay if you feel like you're still working on this. Um, but maybe, I don't know, like, how are we feeling? Like five more minutes? Did we have everyone hold on okay. what they've done so far just so we can yeah. start art for a minute? There we go. So I did that. Okay. Very cool. Nice. Nice. I love all the different choices. Let's check what? Oh, look at that. This is what I have so far. I've uh, only gotten from uh, the top down halfway. Oh, I love your sky. This is what I got so far. Oh, yeah, look at that. 
on the same painting. It's so cool. Everyone sees things differently. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yeah. 13 colors to a beach color. Alright, next up we have the Wiki Stick 3D that you can model any sculptures. It has cover with wax. See one? You can after you just like you're making candles. I'm gonna get this over. Hold them up when you're ready so that we know we can start. Hang on. Oh, that's Here. that kind of sticky wax. Here they are. There we go. I just said we might be almost. I think most people have their wiki sticks out. Okay. All right. Great. Okay, cool. All right. So I told you, um, starting out, that these are two kind of, a, of my favorite materials, but not the kinds of things that you think about when you're sometimes going to make art. So we saw carbon paper, right? It allows you to do something, to draw, which is a whole, you know, art, an art process. Um, but it takes the pressure off of us and lets us just have fun with it. We're not so worried about making things perfect. Um, and that's why I love wiki sticks. Uh, so as you feel them, you'll notice they're sort of covered with a soft, um, sort of covering, um, and that's wax. It's not quite wax you find in candles. It's a much softer wax, a little bit more, a uh, little softer than wax and crayons. Um, so what's cool about that is that our fingertips have body heat. Um, not a lot, you know, not like, oh, I'm so hot. Uh, well, there's, it depends who you ask. Um, but yeah, so just using our fingertips can melt this wax just enough so that you can make it stick together and you can make it stick to other things. Um, the amazing thing that I love about it is, and we talked about this with the carbon paper, so let's say I put this together and I was like, ew, I didn't want that at all. It easily comes apart and I can easily do something new with it. So these are also reusable. Um, and so I'm going to show you very quickly a couple techniques, um, by which I mean ways of using these uh, wiki sticks. Uh, Sorry yeah. for interrupting. That's a question. Can we use any colors? Like, do one color like, behave differently from another color? Excellent question. I am so glad that somebody asked that because you know, I'm going to answer that when I present these. Absolutely no difference. Um, they're all made of the same material, which is like a little kind of like rope inside covered with this wax. So they're all exactly the same. Um, and you'll see, we don't actually draw with these. Um, if I try to use these on a piece of paper, nothing will come out, but we draw with them in a different way. Um, so this is when I say we're going to connect our two projects, but I'm going to show you first. Um, so this is a very simple little octopus man who I have made, and I love his big old eyes because he makes me feel like he's really cute. So we're going to walk through one of these, although looking at the side of the thing, you don't even need this. You're like well beyond this. Um, but we would call this a 3D object. It's something that exists in, in space. I, he can walk around, he can lay flat, which is different from a 2D object, which would be something that is flat. And so when I say I like to use wiki sticks for drawing, I have taken my little sculpture guy and I've put him on a piece of paper so he won't fall off and he'll just live there and be my little drawing. And it was as easy as using these and sticking them on. And I'll show you that. Um, you could also use them on canvas. I am a painter and this is my favorite thing to play with is putting these on canvas because I can make things out, right? We can do 3D sticking out objects. I can make wiggly shapes. I can make lines into other shapes. 
you can use them as drawing and coloring tools. Uh, so, what we're going to look at after we do our little octopus, now maybe we'll do this first, is maybe take one of your drawings or your drawing from earlier, it doesn't matter if it's colored in or not, and take, let's say two, does that work? Yeah, here we go. Let's take two wiki sticks. Um, I have decided that I want my guy to be wearing an orange jacket, but I really don't want to color it in with colored pencil. My hand hurts. I just, what am I going to do? I can take my wiki sticks and I can just press them down. As you see, I take one and I press it down and I move a little and I press it down. And then I have added color to my drawing without having to even, you know, bother with paint or colored pencils. So it doesn't matter if you don't like holding on to something. It doesn't matter if you um, have trouble seeing something. These are so helpful because you can feel it. It's not fully flat on the paper. So if someone has trouble seeing and I say, hey, I did this octopus, they can actually feel my octopus. So that's kind of just like a cool another thing about wiki sticks. You see, I love them. They're just, so you can do anything with them. Um, so let's start, let's see. I don't want to rush, we have time, right? Anything? All right. Um, oh, I I'm gonna see how, this. I just sort of put on I'm there. gonna make it's it for it. Sort of like stick it there, it's not going to, you have to get okay. it. that little bit of um, heat, of body heat, finger Now I just want to get, this right. um, like has a wax in the cupboard. So they really stick to anything, but they don't stick permanently to anything. So if you add something in and you say, I hate this color so much, you take it right off, no big deal. Um, I think these sculptures, actually. So I made this little circle coming out from my house, but I hate it so much, I just pulled it off. And now I'm going to wear it as a ring, because I like it more as a ring. So if you see, these things can be used. It's an endless, endless use. That's why I love them so much. Um, so let's start with paper, though. Let's start with um, practicing with putting these on paper. Um, that's going to be our simplest sort of start. So if you'd like to keep working on your piece and you want to add in some color with wiki sticks, you can try that. So maybe I just want to, um, I just want to give his jacket like a line there because it has no line. And so I just used the wiki stick. It bends very easily, as you see, you can easily make a shape with it. I've made a circle with it, it sticks to itself. And now I've put that circle down. And I have now done a whole thing here, which actually, I'm not gonna lie, I like a little bit more than the original drawing. I like what's happening. Um, so think of these as ways to, A, color without needing to use a colored pencil, or B, guy using it on top of colored pencils so I have oh I have an orange here and now I'm going to take my orangish wiki stick and I'm going to curl it up around the orange be good, but. Huh, just give you guys. so I've added a whole new element totally different again to my little drawing um, so just stick it right into it, it for, like for my cleaner. For um, making lines. There we go. Go back to this. Oh, hold on, I'm just getting you guys. Here. This might be perfect. Do you mean actually coloring with the sticks? What do you mean by coloring with the sticks? No, that's a good... Just like a glit, like, you know, just glittering it, and as sticks. usual. The sticks themselves won't color, right? So if I go like this, in. I mean, I will sit there all day and not get any color. Right. So that's what makes them different from crayons. Uh, Very cool. Three dimensional. That's why they decided. I'm just trying to like how they feel in my fingers too. Um, if you can, you can also stick it to any patterns you want to oh, get right on the paper. It doesn't fall apart. Like I made for, I twist it over just like a pipe cleaner, and it holds right easily. It's, and we'll be able to show it. And made well, it's almost I made for. Like yeah, these, a star here. body. Oh, now I can make. Oh, I have 
any details about the weight sticks. You could equally make a really nice. Oh, Maybe we should show up for it. the lollipop round. I'm just gonna get. Or you can, you can make it any models that you always prefer. There you go. I love it. Feel free to go, that's why it says. But I'm going to show you a few techniques if we want to make a sculpture. Um, so some of you did flowers, someone did an octopus way better than mine. Um, the way basically you want to build these things is the way I think about it, sort of like on paper, is through shapes. Oh, a shape. And kind of matching up different colors. So Joanne and I should have to do like a little demo of wrapping two colors, which is a great way to get started with a project. So I'm actually going to try wrapping these two colors. Okay. Oh, no place for me. What? No place for me. Yeah. Let me see what the examples are. It, right? You can try wrapping it. Oh, yeah, that's a great one. I'm going to show you the technique that I like. If it's too much, because it is hard to get. Where? Alright, oh. Right, she's going to braid it over. Look what I did. Oh. Can I have you? Hello. Hang on. Hello. Um, wrapping is the next one I'm going to show you. Uh, so if you want to, the way I like to do things, oh I like <laughs> to wrap this up into sort of like a flat circle. So this you can do with one piece of wiki sticks. You can do like we did, like Joanne had with the wrapped wiki sticks. Well, this is what it might look like one color. But what if you say like, oh, it's just really hard for me to wrap these things. I, I really, you know, they're too little and it's too small. Just take it and yeah. turn it into a ball. And so then from a ball, if this is too much or just too, you know, you don't want to deal with it, you can just squish a bigger ball. And then I have a ball of wiki sticks. So what I was thinking was, and this really, I can't tell, please tell me if it looks like a spider. I don't know. Hmm. Um, can we see? Yeah. So what I did was I twisted up like I was showing you, and then I took four wiki sticks. You can use less if you're using them for other things. It's harder to get the ball apart, but it's doable. Um, we're gonna take four wiki sticks because, as I learned today, how many legs does an octopus have? Okay, it's eight. I forgot. We're all muted. So an octopus has eight legs, right? Although I read something today that said an octopus actually has two arms and six legs, which is like, now that's the only thing I can think about. So I'm really into octopi today. So we're going to get back to our octopus. Uh, so I have my circular octopus head. And then I took four of these because I can bend them in half. And if I bend four things in half, then I end up with... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight legs that my octopus has. And so if you can see here, this is why wiki sticks are so cool. You take it. Can you see that there? Oh, there we go. Sorry. Take your ball or your 
twist or whatever, and you're going to stick it on top of that. And I got two legs on there, and I'm going to take those, and I'm going to stick them on the back, and I got four legs on there. And then I'm going to take these, and I'm going to put them on the side, and how many legs do I have now? I got six legs on there. What do you think I'm going to do with this one? Spoiler alert. <laughs> stick it to the side, and then my octopus has eight legs. He looks really weird with these legs, right? So what I've decided to do is I'm gonna spread them out. I'm gonna give him lots of leg room because he's flying around, he's flying, he's floating around the ocean, you know, like he doesn't need to be all cramped up with his legs. That's what I'm making a very simple octopus. <laughs> All right, let me just give you guys to show this one for the way to fix. Uh, you see, I, I made this other part. Check this out. I, I made for this beautiful hold up with the heart. I got this one. I twist it over with the, you know, it's kind of the wax seal for the way he sticks. Uh, you make sure I make mean with the bow. Oh, sorry. Here with the echo sounds <laughs> anyway. Look what everyone else is just made for on the sticks. Well, there she is. Look at all these details. I'm just going to get the vlog review. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, oh, oh. oh. You gotta love this part. Um, hopefully, I'm sure. Oh, I forgot to tell you that I got, I just made the last part. I hold up the beautiful part. <laughs> Can you see that, guys? <laughs> Why does not anyone else can see mine? <laughs> okay, one, one person at a time, all right? It's too much crowded. <laughs> well, let me give, give the chat. You know what? Um, they don't want to get back to a live streaming. I just want to make for the last part of the heart. And I made with the bow. I just twist it over with the braid. I'm just giving you everything. Hold on, I'm gonna get this set over. They didn't see me. I'm getting back to live streaming. I don't know why. So anyway, you can find out here for Essential Eyes that you can follow it. Any other social media. Write me in comments below. If you want to write something for me? If, you have to make sure to be always before sharing because just you want to get just you just watch all my videos had to view it and I need to see you to get things right through. Don't forget to give a big thumbs up for everyone. Don't get the dislike. All right, you understood that? Just give it a big thumbs up for everyone. So you have to subscribe to my channel on YouTube, and I will see you for. Another day or so on. And once leaving for me, that I, it's, I got only one person for myself. I'm the only for the selfish. Laura just already replied for my Gmail. And she said to me, Hi Kyle, sorry, but I have another meeting I had to jump into for the info. Please post a picture if your work on our Facebook page would love to see. Thank you for joining us today. Well, Laura's going to get to reply for another meeting. I'll just go to talk to you guys for later that on, and I'll get to back on the news for this topic. So, anyway, happy not art, or not, not the art. So happy not World Day Syndromes. Are you a fan of our videos? Be sure to subscribe to Worldwide Campus News and Entertainment. Then ring the bell to see all notifications about the new videos and the latest video.